<laughs> He's so mad. He's like, what's this stuff? <laughs> Good morning, everyone. We're uh, it's bright and early. We're just getting ready to take Tyler to his football conditioning class. And who do we have here? Who is that? Harley. Poor who Harley has to get shots today. Harley going to get a shot today. He's, he's all happy and he has no idea what he's got in store. Poor and little he has buddy. No idea what he has to go to today. None whatsoever. And we had a little bit of a disaster here this morning. Um, one of Tyler's exercises is to do a juke thing that he can't wear his cleats for. We can't find his regular shoes, so uh, we think they might be in the other car, which is at the shop right now, so I gotta drive over there real quick and just check and see, so. Meantime, this is like the craziest thing. Look at this guy's hair. It, we, he wakes up every morning with the craziest hairdo, so we gotta make him look like a little stud again, and then we're gonna be off to the mechanic to see if we can find Tyler's missing shoes, so we will be back in a moment. So guys, we just got to practice. Oh. You just filmed the uh, <laughs> in the sunshade. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy's trying to clean up the house and Harley is just having a blast chasing the broom. Look at him. It's like, why doesn't this thing want to play with me? It's like, come back. It's making it very <laughs> difficult to get the house clean. <laughs> He's the whole reason it has to be cleaned. He's <laughs> like, it taxes. Uh, Beware of the multi poo. <laughs> The multi poo killer dog. We should put a sign up, um, on our window. Uh, uh, look at him. <laughs> warning multi poo attack dog. <laughs> Let go. Come on, Harley, you can do it. Let go. There's yippy stuff on there. Let go, you crazy. You're crazy. All right, time to get to work. I feel like I did better than all the rest of the days, but he did not know what I did because he fell asleep. Only at the last half. I saw the beginning and you did look really good, especially on the ladder drills there. How did those shoes work out there for you? They're good, it's just they're really small. My heel wasn't hurting, but the front of my toes were. <laughs> guess what? I talked to your mom on the phone and we're, guess where your shoes are? Where? In the bathroom. Did you check the bathroom? Yes. No, you didn't, because if you did, you would have found your shoes. Okay, so Harley doesn't know what this thing is and every time it comes backwards, he gets... <laughs> My armor came. <laughs> Your armor? My football gear came. Sweet. This that what are, looks awesome. What are those? What are those? Chest piece. Look at that, man. I'm gonna put it on. Alright, so <laughs> hit you. Hit me. Uh, did you feel that? Barely. Barely. <laughs> I only felt like the armor pushing against me, not the actual hit. That stuff is like made out of the oh same God. material that they make bulletproof vests. This is and they awesome. got like special padding this in there. It's so good. Okay, I want you to stand, stand up looking forward and don't move. <laughs> so big. Awesome. Oh my god, that's such a cool looking helmet. Look at that face mask. Yeah, we'll, we'll get it tightened up there for you in a minute, man. Just put it on right now. Oh, that. it smells so nice. <laughs> it smells so nice. Look at that. That is a cool looking helmet. 
But yeah, we got this equipment from Zenith Football Equipment. They are uh, awesome. I, do a, I did a lot of research, you know, I mean, it, it tackle, right now the rules make the game really, really safe, but it, it, there still is an element of danger and risk out there, so I wanna make sure that my boys got the best equipment out there. So I did a lot of research. Zenith has the highest safety ratings out of any of the football equipment out there. It's very reasonably priced, and um, their technology that they put in, they're a relatively new company. They've only been around for a few years. Oh my gosh, but they, they have like airbags in it. I can feel like the air. Yeah. I can see it too. Yeah, so it, it, the way that it fits and the, the way that it diverts energy away from the head when, when impacts are done, it's nothing like any other helmet does. So if you play football or if you got a kid that's gonna play football, I highly recommend Follow the link down below, okay? We got a link to the website right there. You can watch their tutorials. You can see what I what I found out through my research on um, why I am so excited about this equipment here. I've never had my arms with this high. A lot of mobility. It's very, very light. I mean, this stuff is, like I said, it's made out of the same stuff that they make uh, bulletproof vests out of. Like, he is going to be indestructible this year. It's gonna be a lot of fun. <gasps> so, Zenith. The big X, it looks cool too. I mean, look at that. I'm gonna get a close up of the helmet here, right here. You gotta take a look at that. Look at that helmet. I wanna, I wanna see. Hold on a second, buddy. I gotta, I gotta be able to see what I'm doing here. Uh, I don't have light again. Okay, here we go. Now, <laughs> quit moving your head. I'm trying to get this side there. There we go, look at that. You got like these like cool little air ducts right there. I wanna see. And then, yeah, I wanna see. Tyler wants to take a look at himself right here. Yeah. Looks awesome. <laughs> Looks awesome. These pads feel so good. Thank you, Zena. I've been playing football for three years. Nothing has been this good. It feels so good. I can make my arms go up and down. I've never had shoulder pads that do that before. Can't feel anything. Oh my God. Zenith, you are awesome. Thank you. All right, you ready to take him to the vet? Yep, he's gonna get all his uh, vaccinations. The rest of his vaccines. Yeah. Come on, Harley, let's go. Gotta bring the dog food because it's not puppy food, so we're gonna see bring it. the vet. Grab it. Did you get the dog food? Yes, yeah, in the daddy's office. Okay. We're gonna check up with the vet. See. So we're gonna take Harley to the vet for his uh, checkup. He's still working on getting his vaccines, and then he should be good. So let's go. Okay, so now he's four pounds. Last week he was only 3.6, so he's been going. Almost a half a pound in one week. Are you sure he's not a lab or a golden retriever, I mean? Maybe he's just gonna blow up on you guys. <laughs> <laughs> he's on his little paws, I don't think so. Yeah. Maybe his stethoscope's as big as you. So this is Dr. Herb, and he is our local vet, and he is taking care of Harley for us. And so far, so good. You said everything checks out. He sounds great. He sounds great. Yay! Give me back to my animal grabbers. <laughs> back to my animal grabbers. Okay, guys, so we just got finished with the vet, and Harley is all tuckered out, and he's just sitting here right by me. And we're going to take him to PetSmart real quick so that we can get him a name tag, like the ID tag with the phone number and his name. And yeah, we're going to bring you guys with us. And maybe you guys can help us pick out which tag. <laughs> okay, so we're looking at all of them. There's all the tags. Ooh, yeah, that's a cute one. Where does the name looks go? really big, though. Those Let's are big. Those are tiny. Lots of That's tags. like the smallest tag they have. That one with the paw print on it's kind of cute. I don't want it to be too big because we don't want it to pull on his head or his neck. We, pull. we need it to be light, a lightweight tag so it doesn't hurt his poor little neck. What about that? That's what it's like. This is the one that's the Molly. Mm. That one's kind of cute too, but it's still big, huh? Okay, so we're getting him two tags, one for each of his collars because we got we have two collars at home. So we don't want it to matter which one he gets. So they're going to be really simple because we need something light. Yes. Because he's teeny and all and the I want tags to pick are out too a heavy. Okay. Kayla wants to pick out a collar. So let's see what kind of collars they have. I like this tag. Uh -huh. So cute. 
freaking out over the collar, sorry. Just don't mind. So we picked out a couple toys. We got some little teeny baby tennis balls and a new little squeaky toy. Because he wrecked his other one. <laughs> yeah. And then what did you get? Some treats there? We have biscuits for little him. Little biscuits that we're going to cut up and make even smaller because he is really small and we don't want him to fill up on junk food. Even though it says it's all natural. Okay, we're going to make his tag. Let's see how this works. So we're putting the tag in. Second part. There it goes. There's Harley's name. I like the print you chose. Yeah, it's kind of artsy, huh? Yeah. It's not even touching it, and it's engraving. It's so weird. Yay! All done. Get a miss. Tuckered out. He was, he's ready to go home. Poor we went baby. To the vet, and then when we came to PetSmart, everyone was like, "Oh, he's so cute." Everyone was wanting to cuddle him. Now he's tired. We have a special guest today, <laughs> and her name hair. is Gabby. I have bad hair today, though. <laughs> oh, you're she fine. She just got back from cheer, <laughs> and she's going to be doing a spend the night with us. Yay! So, we just introduced her to Harley, even though she's already met him. Yeah, they're playing she with Harley right hair. now. He loves and my hair. Yes. And my toes. Hair. He, he loves like everything about me. <laughs> <laughs> he so, took my socks away. What can we say? You know, he loves cute little girls. <laughs> yep. And then we're getting ready to do the barbecue. So we're going to be eating and hopefully after that we can go swimming. Yeah. Yes. So yes. Let's, let's check out this barbecue situation. All right, so how are you doing out here? I know Sean's been running back and forth. He's trying to do 500 things at the same time, helping me barbecue, and he's working, and I'm working, and we're all working, and it's <laughs> Working crazy. hard and loving life, baby. But uh, you know how that goes, so. All right, so hopefully within a few minutes we'll be eating, and I don't know what Tyler's doing. What have you been up to? I'm trying to bunny hop. Trying to bunny hop. BMX. Oh, and that's the french fries. So, you've been doing a, what's that BMX? Is that on the computer? <laughs> it's a bike. Okay, I thought that there might have been a BMX game. <laughs> I don't know. Laugh at me all you want, but is, we're gonna be eating dinner in a minute. Is my computer on? Uh, usually you play on there. What about your guitar? Have you played that lately? Brown. Maybe she get on that. Every day, dude. Do some practicing. Woohoo! I'm dancing. I'm bad at that part. Well, it sounds like you're making progress there. So uh, why don't you uh, keep practicing on that for a few minutes? We're gonna practice making burgers because we need to practice. Hey you guys, did you finish uh, eating? Yeah. No, we're pretty full. Yeah. So do you guys want to? I'm trying to get the plate. I never seen anybody so excited for a fly. I'm trying to get. Do you guys want to go swimming? Yeah. Yes. Well, get your bathing suits on. Let's go because no. I don't know how late the uh, pool's open and I don't want to miss out. We made it! Yay! There's time. So let's see what the kids can do. We got a few minutes before they close this park on us. Tonight we are running on the right track. If I ever saw one. <laughs> Last little few minutes at the pool before they close it down, and we're just enjoying the sunset. Yeah, a little bit more daylight left, and then it'll be nighttime again. Oh, I should be happy. Yay! Night, nighttime. <laughs> we get to go sleepy soon. So when we're done here, I think that's it for us. But anyway, so we're gonna pack up. We're gonna head home, and the kids are going to do some face painting and it's not just any kind of face painting it's gonna be glow-in-the-dark face painting so on who on themselves 
themselves. Oh, okay, cool. Not me or you? Sweet. <laughs> I think it'd be more fun to watch them do it. Yeah, they have so. big ideas, so let's right. see what they do. Tonight we're running on the right track. Uh, a cold! Oh, uh, that's a good one! 